One of the things that she has always reminded us year after year after year is that we all um, are committed to doing one thing, which is graduating every single student one student at a time, which I know she stole from Mr. Garrison, um, but she did make it her own. Um, and that is something that sticks in my mind every single day as we work to have a student-centered um, school climate and culture. And I still remember the first day when I met all of the staff and Miss Kingston came up in front of everyone and talked about how, yeah, there is a reputation that Vallejo has overall, but that doesn't mean that the individual students that we have here are actually going to fit into those stereotypes. And overall, Ms. Kingston made me excited and proud to work with a population that sometimes doesn't get the help they need. And I think that overall, everything that she's done to help out this school, it's been a great benefit to everyone. What I'm going to miss most about Ms. Kingston is seeing her at every school event, seeing her car in the parking lot well into the night because she's always here, always working. She's here on the weekends. She's at every football game. Um, working with her felt like family and it felt like she was always here taking care of us. Ms. Kingston was super helpful for me in that um, she helped to provide an opportunity for me to be here at Jesse Bethel um, and I really appreciated having that opportunity to come from Oakland Unified to come work at Vallejo City Unified, specifically at Jesse Bethel with a great group of adults and kids. She's always said uh, this to me and, and even to our larger group as a whole. Uh, how do, we, how do we know the kids got it? What do we do if they didn't? And what, if, what do we do if they did? Well, I'm really thankful for Ms. Kingston for actually interviewing me and hiring me to be a teacher at Jesse Bethel High School, my alma mater. And I really appreciate her um, support over the years. And I'm really going to miss her. And I really appreciate that you told me that I'm a good teacher. Thank you. To tell you the truth, I feel very sad that she's leaving because she dealt with people like me who have an accent, uh, very straightforward, uh, very open, and uh, she always dealt with me uh, and uh, she showed kindness, she showed understanding. I would like to say that I know wherever she goes, she's going to be incredibly successful, as long as she stays uh, who she is at heart. Um, I think it's served her well here, and I know uh, it'll serve her well in other places. I'm going to miss her gentle and kind nature. Um, she's been a very supportive principal to me and to all of us, and I'm just very grateful that she's been our principal and helped us so much. Um, I'm going to miss her open door. Um, she's always taken time to open her doors and, and be there for me and for all of us. My first impression of Linda, um, we were up waiting to meet our new principal and I was, we were in the student union, all the teachers were. And I was doing my football stuff, I, listening to what was being said. And Linda came in and she held the football. She had me from that point on, and I remember what she said. She said, as a staff and as a school, we're going to take that football and march it down the field and get this school right. 